Hey everybody, uh, I'm sitting by myself. Oh, Tyler! Oh, hey man, hey. what's up? Didn't want to have to do this by myself, Wait, but glad you're John? here. Is it Josh? Josh. You're, Good to meet you. Yeah, Josh. what's your name again? Um, Tyler. I just said it. Cool. So I know. We're um, 21 Pilots, and this is our FAQ. Which also could mean... Uh, people think it's frequently asked questions, but it's actually fairly athletic quails. Yeah, fairly athletic quails is what we're here Which to they talk are. about today. Which they are. They are. Absolutely. They're, they're very, if you watch a quail go, you're just like, wow, athleticism dripping off of that foul. Um, yeah. So what is this? So basically what this is, um, is I have a hat here and there's paper in it. Okay. On the paper is a question. A quail. A quail that I will be presenting to you mm -hmm. and you will let me know basically how fairly athletic they are. Got it. So Hit me. First quail. Uh, the best way to spend a day off? That's it. That's what it says, so I that read it is, as a question. That is great. It's not even grammatically correct, but that's um, my best, question for you. Best day, best time, or best thing to do while spending a day off is just is setting up a tripod, putting up a video camera, and just going, "Hey, Josh, let's do some videos." Yeah. And, you know, shake it up and be hilarious. Good, cool. I'll right, let let's you do, do that on quail. Your day off. Let's see if this one's athletic. Quail. Um, worst song you've ever heard? Oh, the worst song I've ever heard. Yep. Um, you also have to sing it, it says. Oh, it also it sings, says sing Yeah, it. it says also, also Don't see sing that. It. Don't see that part. It's there. Um, the worst song I've ever heard is... Uh, I love every song. See, that's the problem, is I love all the songs. Um, but the worst one I've ever heard was one that was that my sister was singing that she was... She wrote it. Okay. I don't and remember how, the words. I remember it. Yeah, it was basically... It's like... like you... you are taking so long, San Francisco. Yeah, that was a pretty bad song. My sister wrote it. And I guess you, you heard it too. Yeah, she put it out on sucked. iTunes and sucked. we hate it. Um, Alright, I got a quail for you. Go hit me. Uh, what is the most embarrassing song on your playlist? Oh, it goes like this. I know it. <laughs> come on, come on. <laughs> You are taking <laughs> so long. It's my sister's song. San Francisco. <laughs> why does San Francisco keep taking so long? I, <laughs> seriously, why does it take so long? And why did my sister write a song about it? Why is it on your playlist? It sucks. I know. Hey, okay. Hit me with a quail. It's a bad song. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. This is going to be a good one. Yeah. Josh, if you could play in any other band, what would it be? Um, if I could play in any other band, it'd probably be uh, the. Uh, oh boy, this is tough. Um, probably the Beatles. Go ahead next. Okay. Are you okay? No, I'm fine. I, can, I, can I start over? I feel really bad about that. It would probably be Queen. Oh, cool. <laughs> okay. Next. All right. Hit me with I didn't want to hurt your feelings. Thanks, buddy. Yeah. Because right. they're broken up. They don't exist. That's so, true. Yeah. Which means you have to It wouldn't even band. be possible for right. me to play with Queen. <laughs> I mean, what was yeah, I thinking? Doesn't mean, All right. Some of them anyway. aren't alive. Yeah, seriously. Tyler, is there any song you wish you would have written? Mmm. There's a song. Um, by uh, Abby Dunn. Oh, yeah. My sister. <laughs> and uh, I think we all know it. You are, are taking, taking too long, long San Francisco. Francisco. Alright. I wish I had written that. Oh, yeah, I know. It's a gem. Josh, would you rather have no knees or no elbows? <laughs> Heavy. Well... Heavy quail there. That's a... That's a... Basically, a, do you want this your whole life? Or do you want this your whole life? Um, here's the thing. I think it would be, if I didn't have any knees, mm -hmm. I would be considered a freak. Okay. Uh, same with the no elbows, but I would rather be able to eat food, and I would just eat a ton of it, and, and I would be overweight because I'm already 
people are already looking at me anyway, so they might as well look at me because I love food. I love to eat. Mm -hmm. um, so no knees? I'd probably go no knees so that I could uh, eat. Food. I bet you could figure out a way. If to you eat. had no elbows, you could get the food. You could prepare the food out here. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I'm saying? So you're preparing food, you're preparing food, Right. you grab your utensils, you push the utensils over, so you got the utensils and the food, but then you realize I can't use their utensils, so then you kind of like hit those off. <laughs> yeah. You know, but then what, you once you the food, with your, you the food is the, prepared, watch this. No, no, you don't need your feet, you just go like this. You go like this. you pull, hold your arms up like this, and you just... <laughs> Drop it in? You just start eating it. It's on oh, the table. Like right on the it's table. on the table, where are you preparing? Then why do you have to put your hands in the air like that? I just get them out of the way. That's true. You know what I mean? You, you can just, also just go like You don't want to hit them. Like, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. Hit me with another quail. All right, you ready? Yeah. All right, moving on. Tyler Joseph of That's 21 me. Pilots. Mm -hmm. What's the most useless thing you've ever bought? Um, one time I bought this fedora, and I was like, I'll never use this. But then I realized, hey, I got a bunch of questions written on pieces of Quails. paper. Quails. Quails. Why don't I put them in this fedora? Yeah. And give it to Josh, and we'll shoot a video. So it wasn't that useless. It wasn't. It was. Uh, it was I'm actually... glad he bought this thing. It's a uh, Stetson. It's yeah. a good brand. It is a good brand. It's, um, it's, it smells like it doesn't smell that like great, but uh, Josh, what's the weirdest rumor you've heard about yourself? Weirdest rumor that I've ever heard about myself is probably that I um, that I went to went to college your university and that I am smart and that I have friends and that I that I'm cool and popular and none of it's none of it's true I get bullied <laughs> it's okay cuz uh, we're friends and uh, I will 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 always be friends um, unless you make me really mad so okay. just uh, tiptoe around that if you could okay hit me all right buddy you're looking Cool I'm not today. your buddy guy. <laughs> Tyler, what's your favorite app? Oh. Um, probably. Mmm. Mmm, probably the the yellow delicious. Oh, is that a sushi? Wait, you say apple? Oh no, I said app. Oh, app. Like it could be appetizer. Mm -hmm. Could be like mozzarella sticks. I would have to pray. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go with the mozzo sticks. Yeah, those are delicious. I'd probably. Well, it's not even my question. Yeah, so what are you doing? To, nobody Shut cares. Shut your face. Nobody cares what my favorite app is. Um, Josh, what's the funniest thing that happened to you on stage? You you're on stage sometimes. Sometimes what I'm do you on do? stage. Uh, I mostly just sit there and, but nobody. Nobody like really notices. No, notices. They don't I know. know. I know. Um, I've been told that. The funniest thing that almost happened to me on, that happened to me on stage was that I almost pooped my pants. That's true. <laughs> it's um, true. Yeah. I was there. Yeah, he was there. I, I was there. I, I I I told Tyler about it. We were bowing actually. We were in we Mexico. Were... We were in Mexico City, and we bowed. And he looked over at me and. And I said, I'm about to poop, I'm my, about pants. To poop my pants. That's and I'm, I'm sorry if that makes you feel uncomfortable, but it's it. Uh, it's not nearly as uncomfortable as Josh was feeling at the moment. Yeah. So don't even feel uncomfortable. Yeah. I almost, I almost in between songs ran off stage. <laughs> <laughs> I would have had to have talked for a while. <laughs> yeah. Think. Well, a while. I mean, I would probably have been forced to bring up why you were off stage. <laughs> probably. So let's not have that happen anymore. Yeah. All right. Um, How many quails are left? We got one quail left. Let's one make it left. a good one. One the quail left. The Indiana Jones. <laughs> um, all right. Hit me. You ready? This yes. is a good one. This is a big one. Who's the most famous person in your phone book in your contacts list? <gasps> I'm going through it right now. Mm -hmm. I'm going through it. Still, I'm still going. I'm at the bees now. Okay. So you, you got a lot of people. Yeah, right. you're gonna have to wait. Okay. C. Nobody with the name B. Nope. Uh, there's this guy named Josh Dunn. Um, he plays the drums for a band called Twenty One Pilots, and he brings so much energy to the show. And I've heard of him. Everyone likes him, and he's one of the coolest guys we've ever met. I've heard that's a rumor, though. It's the cool. The cool thing? Yeah. Yeah, he's actually pretty nerdy. Um, 
But, you know, that's why everyone likes him. We're just like, hey, that's Josh. He's, like, mysterious because he doesn't really sing and talk that much, but he plays the drums live. And everyone likes Mystery Man. You know what I mean? So that's it's actually his name in my phone. It's Josh Mystery Man. Um, oh, that's cool. Yeah, so um, he never texts me back, but um, we're pretty close. Yeah. Guys, that was our fairly athletic quails. Also, sometimes not as frequently asked questions, but mostly frequently athletic questions. Quail, fa fairly athletic quails. It's fairly. confusing the way that people do these things yeah. these days. But thanks for having us. Thank you. And we'll see you on another place at another time.